you want to apply the FCC Act to your DJI FPV drone, I'm going to show you two ways to do it. First with your smartphone and the second way with your laptop or desktop computer. And at the end of the video, we'll have some FAQ. In the previous video, we saw that the video transmission and radio transmission on your DJI FPV drone are locked by European laws. Radio transmission is a transmission between the drone and the remote controller. It's 100 milliwatts in the 5.8 gigahertz band. The video transmission is a transmission between the drone and the goggles. It is 20 5 milliwatts in the 2.4 gigahertz band so we are talking at least for europe i don't know about the other zones of the world but europe is where i live so this is what i'm going to talk about if you are to fly your dji fpe drone in the usa radio and video transmission are both 1412 milliwatts in the 2.4 gigahertz and 5.8 8 gigahertz bands. So I'm going to show you how to apply the DJI FCC Act from your smartphone. Uh, first, I just wanted to warn you, just make sure that your OTG cable is connected to your goggles, then connected to USB-A, then USB-C to your phone. This is how it works with the smartphone. So what you need to do is download the Beyond app. You press start now, power on your drone. So we already did that. Power on your FP goggles, it's already done. You press next. Okay, connect your USB cable. So as I told you before, OTG cable on the goggles, then the USB-C to USB-A cable. Okay, so you just need to wait. It is scanning your FPV goggles. Just press next, it's connecting. Yeah, unlocking. Please wait while we unlock your FPV drone. Okay, as simple as that, your drone is unlocked to its full power. I'm going to reset all that and I'm going to show you how to do it from your laptop or desktop computer. So what I'm just going to do is just relaunch the DJI Fly app and it will reset everything. But I won't film that. Just go back to DJI Fly app and you'll know how to do it. Okay, so now I'm going to show you how to do it from your laptop or desktop computer. So you just need to go to this link. I'll put the, the website link in the description down below. So you just click on unlock my drone now. Okay, you press start now, power on your drone, press next, power on your FP goggles, press next, connect your USB cable. Uh, something I wanted to mention when we did with the smartphone, here we've connected the OTG cable then the USB-C to USB-A cable so the OTG cable was connected to the goggle and the other cable was connected to the smartphone here connect your USB-C to USB-A cable connect it straight to your goggles otherwise your goggles will not be recognized by your computer that's the only difference okay so I will press next scanning okay I'll press next again here it is, connect, then it's connecting to the goggles. Please wait while we ensure there's a stable connection. Sorry for the noise. DJI FPV is very noisy, even when it does not fly, sorry. So unlocking, please wait while we unlock your drone. Here it is, as simple as that. And I'm just going to show you something down below. You can see here, the power of your drone when it's not unlocked so it's at 1.25 milliwatts when you unlock it it's nearly like 300 times more powerful so frequently asked questions first question can this break my dji fpv drone the answer is no the software simply sends a command to your DJI FPV drone that will change its region to US, unlocking full radio power on the drone. No permanent modification is made. Connecting your drone back to the DJI Fly app will reset the location on your DJI FPV drone to its default. You can reapply the modification at any time by visiting this page. Will this invalidate my warranty? The answer is no. A modification makes no permanent change to your DJI FPE drone. Connecting your drone back to the DJI Fly app will reset the region on your DJI FPE drone to its default. Will my range 
be better? The answer is yes. The DJI FPV drone will be unlocked from 25 milliwatts to staggering 1412 milliwatts, substantially increasing the range, reliability and signal penetration through objects of your DJI FPV drone. Could the flying characteristics be altered? The answer is no. The only change made to your DJI FPV drone is the region. Increasing the output power of the transmitters, no other changes are made to your DJI FPV drone. Is this really free? The answer is yes. We strongly believe in paying it forward. You've already spent a lot on your DJI FPV drone. Why should you have to pay more just to be able to use it to its full potential? If our software helped you, you can make a donation with the button below. This helps encourage us to make more great software and release it for free for all to use. My device does not show up. Ensure you are running Chrome version 89 or Edge version 89 or above. Restart your web browser. Follow all the steps in the guide exactly. Reconnect your DJI FPV drone. Ensure your drone goggles have at least 50% of charge. Where can I get the mobile app? You can find the Beyond on Google Play. I don't like using Chrome or Edge. Is there a desktop app? Not to worry, we have a Windows native app you can download here. We wanted to release an app for Mac to however, there's an insane amount of hoops to jump through with them just to allow an end user to install it. For the minute, we recommend using the latest Chrome on Mac if possible. Can I use this on my website? Sure. We built a handy little snippet that will allow you to embed your unlocker on your website.